It's here. time to meet our pet of the week this morning. Here to introduce us is Lee Turbot from the Montgomery Humane Society. Tell us about this sweet guy. This is Fred. He's two months old. He's a little bulldog terrier mix. He is so sweet. And of course, he's a puppy. So he's doing his little chewing stages right now. Loves to play. Loves to be held. But just a sweet little boy. He's going to probably be medium size. Yeah. Um, his little tummy's a little full right now. But He's just chilled and relaxed like he wants to take a nap right now. Yes, <laughs> we've been playing with him to try to tire him out. Do you have a lot of puppies like Fred right now at the shelter? We do. We have a lot of puppies right now, great variety. So please, if you're looking for a pet, you can come to our shelter at 1150 John Overton Drive. We're open seven days a week. Just go to the um, website and fill out your application. And that's great that you have a variety. I know you work really hard to match families with a pet that's going to be perfect for them. Yes. Um, this weekend we had, you know, the Subaru event and, we, you know, a lot of people asked us, you know, what kind of dogs that, you know, are energized, that like to run and everything. So we try to find out what their lifestyle is so we can match them up with the perfect pet. It's very important that you consider the lifestyle of that pet, what they are going to need. That's and that it's right. a lifetime of commitment for those pets. Exactly. This one, um, you know, average 15 years, you know, giving them a good life. They need exercise too. They need a schedule just like a baby. So get them house trained and everything. So it is a big commitment. So you really need to think about it. We had Dr. Myers in here with her older yes. dog, at least 13 years old. I know you have some, some older dogs in there as well, but they are fantastic. They are, and all they need is, you know, just a, a place to live out the rest of their lives. We have several right now that are looking for forever homes, so those are the ones that I would be adopting right now, my life stage. So consider those two. They're all spay and neutered. They're microchipped up to date on their vaccinations and they don't need a lot of attention. They're usually house trained. You don't have to worry about that other training with them chewing and stuff. So. Yes, they have manners. They can walk on a leash. So they just want a good friend. I know besides adopting animals, there are many, many ways that you can support the shelter. What are those? Oh, definitely. Um, volunteering, being a foster parent, you know, go on uh, Amazon.com, um, smile, excuse me, AmazonSmile.com. We have a list of items that we need there, also on Chewy.com. This weekend, we'll be at um, the 5K Pupkin Run oh, on cute. Cloverdale Road. Yes, um, some of our adoptable dogs are going to be out there. So adopt one, go for your run, and you'll have a family when you're done. Sounds like a great weekend, Lee. Thank yes. you. That's this Saturday again there on Cloverdale Road. Thank you, Fred. You're going to be a good boy for somebody. Going to make somebody very happy. Yes. <laughs>